my dearest children. Let me express my deep love and gratitude for your presence on the planet. For the children who have just been born, you have taken on the challenge of improving life on Earth. The newest children are direct descendants of the higher realms. They bring high vibrational experiences to your world. The babies of today are pure and know only love which our planet cries out for. Today's babies will look at you differently than previous babies. They are wiser than you. Their experience is greater than yours. They are masters. If you hold a baby, know that they are not here to teach us anything. They are here to be love and only love. They are here to be of the highest vibration and spread the light. Previous souls needed to learn lessons and came back from previous incarnations. Today's babies have everything they need within them. They come from the highest levels. If you are caring for the babies of today, be assured that all you have to do is provide them with their basic needs and they will flourish. For they have everything they need to understand and cope with today's world. You will find it easier to talk to today's babies. You will communicate more telepathically and intuition will be stronger. Every generation before them had something to undo or fix, but in your new world there will be only love. So all that can be born is love. The little ones will lead the way for their younger brothers and sisters. They have already lived lives and understand what world they are being born into. They are pathfinders for the adults. How to bridge the gap between evil and good. You will find that today's toddlers are the glue that binds the old and the new. They can integrate the old ways with the new and make the worlds blend together. Their role is to make the transition and they will do so seamlessly. If you are a parent of a young child, don't question it. They will be unique in what they do. That is normal. They have come with a plan that they must follow in their role as pathfinders for the new earth. If you wonder why they are doing something, don't be surprised if the answer is wiser than their age. They don't need adults to tell them what to do. They are on a mission. Let them go about their business doing their job. Correct them if they seem to be going the wrong way, but don't contradict them if it's a new way of doing things. You can mix this with that and do that before that. There's no reason why things cannot be done differently from previous years. To the mothers and fathers of today, rejoice in being part of this experience. You have accepted the role of inaugurating high beacons of love and you have had to accept in your hearts the challenge of raising pure love. Your contributions to the education of children will not be forgotten. They do not have to be what you were. They must be what they are. And you must recognize the love that pours out of them, letting it blossom. Today's babies accept love in return. If they are not shown love, they know how to transmute the negative energies. There can only be love. Each generation of children has come for a purpose. To learn lessons, to promote change, to break a system, to ride the wave, to establish the new, to usher in love. Each has its importance. No generation is better than the other. 
recognize all souls for the path they have chosen and determine the future of the world as the age of love. For in the future, there is only love. Hug your children, say prayers at night and enjoy the laughter that comes with youth. Laugh with them at the fun surprises that come their way and pray with them when they need a solution. My blessings to you all as we usher in love. God. This message was channeled by Krista energetically and it was read for you by Adriana. <laughs>